Gold Squad TV. So the Celtics win 106-86 over the Charlotte Hornets. The winner for the fourth time in his last six games. Jason Tatum had 23 points. Evan Fournier had 17. Robert Williams had 18. Jalen Brown had a good game. This game, even Romeo Langford hit a three. He played some damn good defense. Although I'm not a fan of this offense, and I don't care how many games we win, we need to get rid of Brad Stevens. I'm not a fan of this offense, and we're going to find out against Philly why I'm not a fan of this offense. Because Philly is going to slow us down, and they're going to try to play more of a, a slow-down game. We're not capable because the way our roster is constructed and the way we're coached, we are not capable of playing a half-court game, which is very important, especially when the playoffs start. Um, all that three-point shooting shit goes to bed in the playoffs. You can sit there and talk about simple math, three versus two, the three-pointer gets it done. Um, fuck your math. It's that simple. I have not been this unhappy about a win. Probably ever. 116.86 Astros. We won by 30. I have not been this unhappy about a win ever. It has really nothing to do with the fact that we destroyed Charlotte. I just don't like hearing guys like Forsberg talk about the three-pointers in and we just need to do whatever you want. What about just doing something that's not about what the NBA is doing? You know, our personnel clearly is not built to be shooting 51 threes in a game. Yeah, we made a certain bunch and we won. But we face a better team. That's not going to go that way. Not to mention, fans don't pay, nor pay to watch a team full of guys to sit there at the three-point line and shoot threes unless you're the Golden State Warriors. Nobody's paying to watch Jason Tatum sacrifice his skill just to shoot threes. Jalen Brown sacrifice his skill to shoot threes. That's what I don't like about this coach. Too analytical. It's too damn analytical. Too reliant on analytics. It takes away from individual players' traits. And the fucked up part is, you guys don't see it. You're just going to blame the players. But when Jalen Brown gets traded or Jason Tatum gets let go or he goes in free agency one day, you're going to see how much greater he is or they are. To be honest with you, you'll see how much better they are in a different system where they're able to do the things that they do and they're able to win games doing what they do. That is the traditional traditional way of winning all this buck the system three-point shooting shit that analytics tries to tell you that only works in the regular season we it shouldn't gonna be going like that in the full season historically gold squad tv leave your comments down below celtics 116 hornets 86